In this video, we see the integration between Sentinel-1 Endpoint Protection and Fortinet Sandbox. We will see the sharing of blacklist and whitelist entries between the products, shared threat information, and the synchronization between the consoles. First, let's look in the Sentinel-1 Management Console. We see that it does not show any threats and does not show any entries on the blacklist and whitelist. In the network view, we see the endpoints that are connected to this management console. Now let's look in the Fortinet Sandbox console. We see that the whitelist and blacklist is also empty. We look at the latest malware package and see that it has zero entries. Now we go to the connector and launch it in the command line. We can see that the Sentinel-1 management and Fortinet FSA management are configured. The connector starts to monitor the Sentinel-1 activities. In the Sentinel-1 console, we add a new whitelist entry. When the new entry is detected by the connector, the entry is automatically shared to the Fortinet sandbox. We see that the new hash from Sentinel-1 was propagated to the Fortinet sandbox. Let's add a blacklist entry in the Sentinel-1 console. Again we see that when the hash is detected by the connector, it is automatically shared to the Fortinet sandbox. Now we'll delete all entries from the black and white lists in the Sentinel-1 console. The connector detects and propagates the changes to the Fortinet sandbox. Let's see what happens when a threat is detected on an endpoint with a Sentinel-1 agent. The threat shows in the Sentinel-1 dashboard. It is mitigated immediately. We can see that the detecting engine was DBT, the dynamic behavior tracking engine. We can see the hash of the threat detected by the connector at about the same time. It is sent to the Fortinet Sandbox blacklist. Now let's see that the Fortinet Sandbox also propagates information to the Sentinel-1 console. We will reactivate some hashes in an old malware package to create a new malware package. We see that the new package is available in the Fortinet Sandbox. When a new malware package is available, all new entries are detected by the connector and synced back to the Sentinel-1 management console. Thanks for watching.